Hello everyone, this is Stephanie of Creative with Miss Me. And I am outside today. It is beautiful here in Houston today. It's only 78 degrees. And yesterday we were like 94. It is very beautiful out here. It's calming, the birds are singing. I mean, it's really nice out here. And so, <laughs> I came out here to chill for a bit. But um, today I'm gonna do some cleaning. I'm going to tackle my refrigerator, the top part. I want to clean it out, clean the refrigerator out for my husband and I restock the top part of the refrigerator. So I thought I would take you along with me as I cleaned my refrigerator. If this is your first time visiting my channel, please feel free to click that red subscribe button you see down below and next to it a bell will appear. Click that bell and that bell will notify you each and every time I upload a video. And if you're an oldie but a goodie, thank you for coming back my creatives. You know you have my heart. Yeah, I have to organize it, clean it out, get rid of some things that we're not using, things that we didn't use. It's kind of bare. I wait till it gets down before we go and restock. But I know we want to go to restock today, so I need to get it done. So uh, if you enjoy this kind of video, you know what to do. Stick around. Okay, here's my refrigerator. It's a double-sided whirlpool. But it really needs to be cleaned out. It needs to be cleaned out. I'm only going to clean the top half. Here. Only going to be cleaning this portion. The bottom freezer, that will be another task, another day. Because I need to get something to contain all the frozen vegetables that we purchase. I keep all the frozen vegetables and some fish in the bottom. So I'm looking for the containers that I want to use because this freezer is made a little different down at the bottom. And I really can't take out the baskets that came with it. It's, I've tried and I can't get them out. So I'm gonna have to work with what I have. But anyway, I'm gonna clean this part out. It really needs it. Don't judge me. I know I should have done this a while back, but laziness is the key. That's what it is, laziness. So with the wall being so close here, this door will not stand open. It will close on you in a millisecond. So I'm going to stop blabbing. And I'm going to get to work cleaning out this refrigerator.
here is the finished product. This is the item that made it back. <laughs> I put the bread in here because for some reason when I leave it on the side or beside the refrigerator, it dries out quick. So I put it in the refrigerator. My butter's there and those containers will be his and her yogurts. Up top will be the eggs. Of course, that's the milk. My husband loves milk. The water goes in that clear container here, the water bottles. Over there is my husband's adult beverages. Here, one side is for veggies. The other drawer is for fruit. Down here is where we keep the lunch meats and cheeses. Oh, in the back I have pecans and chocolate for cookies. And in the door are my condiments. Here you see it's mustard, ketchup, and that's barbecue sauce. And I love Dijon mustard. It's low, I need to pick up some. Here's mayonnaise, my husband loves mayonnaise for the sandwiches. And then we have some grape jelly. And up here we have a little bit of butter and a stick and the bacon soda. On this side, what made it back was the salad dressings and some sweet pickle relish for hot dogs. And my beef broth, I just opened some biscuits. Um, my ragu, what is this? Classic Alfredo sauce. I keep a jar of pickle juice. My husband has uh, spasms and things like that and the pickle juice seems to work with that. And then we have our mix for our um, uh, smoothies and then a container I keep orange juice in. So here is the top of the refrigerator all sparkly clean, organized, and ready for the new groceries. Oh, also the touch base on the mats I put in the refrigerator. The ones that here, the black and white ones, those came from the Dollar Tree down here and here. And then the mats here, I ordered them off of Amazon because I wanted some clear ones in here on the trays. I will put a link to these in my description box for Amazon if you're interested in ordering these mats. Trying to keep it where it's easy clean up or spills. So if you enjoy my content, you know what to do. Give your girl a thumbs up, comment, and share my video. And also follow me on my social media accounts. They'll be listed down below on the screen as well as in the description box. And as always, this is Stephanie of Creative Limits Me saying thank you for watching and you'll be blessed.